Hello, I've been receiving a lot of correspondence in my inbox and the number one subject that people want to know is how do I book one of the SHA Plus hotels here in Pattaya? As you know, at the beginning of this month, rules were changed. Number one, the quarantine was reduced to seven days. And secondly, you are allowed to stay in Pattaya directly in a Phuket Sandbox style SHA Plus hotel. Book in, take a test and then roam around the hotel grounds and then maybe go on some trips to places that are SHA Plus accredited. But there's only one problem. People don't know which hotels they can book. So, me being Mr Egg, I've gone underground and contacted many of the hotels that are already advertising as being SHA Plus accredited. And they've all got back to me. And they've all kind of said the same thing. We don't know anything. So, what we thought we'd do today is come and have a look at some of the hotels. So you've got an idea of where some of them are and then we'll be telling you a few more details about how you can book but right now I have to say Patia as Genesis once said this is a land of confusion you may be wondering what is this SHA plus that Mr Red keeps mentioning the S stands for safety the H stands for health not quite sure what the A is but anyway it's the official government accreditation that is given to hotels and leisure experiences here in Thailand. 70% of the staff must be vaccinated and the 30% that aren't vaccinated or any staff that aren't vaccinated aren't able to deal with the general public. It's basically a kite mark that says we're safe, we're healthy and you won't come into contact with anybody that hasn't been vaccinated when you come on holiday. We're starting off the tour of the SHA Plus hotels here. We're on at the Citrus Grand Hotel. Now, if you don't quite know where we are, we're just past Walking Street. This is the second road here. It's almost the start or maybe the end of second road. The famous flyover which goes down to Bally High is directly behind the camera. And this hotel has been used as a quarantine hotel for Thai people, really since the beginning of when Thai people were coming back into the country earlier this year. Uh, inside it's very nice. It's got a very nice swimming pool. It's got like a, a space hopper thing. And also, it's within walking distance of Walking Street. Although I have to say, it's neither A, obtainable, or B, open. We've just come down Second Road, and on the left-hand side, we're here at uh, somewhere you've probably seen many, many times if you're a regular here in Pattaya. It's the Avani Pattaya Resort. This used to be, for many years, the Marriott Hotel. It's right um, next to the Royal Garden Plaza and this is a hotel that you can actually book now uh, on Agoda it has an 8.7 rating and let's be honest all of the hotels that I'm gonna take you to and show you today that are SHA plus approved are not at the cheaper end of the market they're a little bit more expensive but look you're gonna be in there for seven days you've been waiting and waiting and waiting to come to Pattaya what are you shell out a little bit, treat yourself and come to a really nice hotel. The Avani here can be booked from 2,400 baht per night, Sea View, 2,000 baht I believe on Agoda and uh, yeah it's great. It's, it's a very very famous plush luxury hotel here in Pattaya and right by the beach so you get a great view of the beach, nice to walk along Beach Road and not a million miles from Walking Street that way or that way you can go to Soibor Cow, LK Metro, Tree Town, etc. Come on here, relax. Certainly hope you have um, a better landing than, uh, than that guy did. We are just a stone's throw from the Avani Hotel. Well, it all depends how strong you are, I suppose just along second road and we are at our next SHA plus hotel which is the hotel 
Barracuda. Uh, just to orientate you, this is the now closed Pagoda Bar, although um, it is only temporarily closed. Although I do hear people say that there is noise coming from behind the corrugated iron, but who knows, maybe it's ghosts. Um, behind me is the Hotel Barracuda. Now, I haven't got a huge amount of information about this hotel. We have contacted the hotel and they've come back to us and says that they are SHA plus accredited and they will be taking bookings for the Sandbox in November. It's 8.5 uh, score on a Goda, which is very good. Um, all we really know about it is, if you book it, you get an a la carte breakfast, well situated uh, for lots of second row bars, and if you like Falang foods, the Robin Hood Tavern is just down the road, and also right here is Villa Market as well. So good location, good score, not much information, but you could stay here. In November. Our next hotel is right here on Beach Road. Behind the camera right now you can see the wonderful beach and we're at the Hotel Tropicana. For those of you who don't know, uh, Soy 6 is just down there. I know a lot of you haven't been to Soy 6. Terrible, terrible place. Um, see my video up there. Uh, so Soy 6 is just there in between Soy 6 and Patia Central. Hotel Tropicana, now these, this was one of the hotels that got back to us when we inquired about their SHA Plus accreditation. They have received that and they will be taking guests in the Patia Sandbox from November. Uh, at the moment, they are taking quarantine guests. Interestingly, um, the price, if you're a Thai for staying here in assisted state quarantine is actually a lot lot cheaper 50 percent cheaper than if you're a foreigner so it looks like a little bit of double pricing for the uh for the quarantine at the moment obviously that might change we haven't got confirmation of the prices here for the patia sandbox from next month but we'll try and keep you informed on that and hopefully we might be able to get inside the hotel sooner because we are talking to the management there one of the great things is, even though it's more expensive for you to stay here at the Tropicana, you do get two free bottles of water every day. So, Hotel Tropicana drinks are free. And they've got the friendliest security guard. He's the only one who hasn't told us to push off. So, comes recommended. Hotel Tropicana here on Beach Road. Just moved on to Soy 7. Uh, behind me is the wonderful beach. Behind the camera, you've got Nick Dean's A7 DJ bar. Uh, looking good there. And a lot of new things on Soy 7, including this new hotel, the Blackwoods Hotel. Uh, SHA Plus approved and taking bookings for November and December and onwards. Um, don't know really much about this. We have been in contact with the management there and uh, we might be hopefully gaining access to have a look around this hotel in the future. Fingers crossed because we'd really like to go inside and see. All we know about it, it's got 69 rooms, no tittering at the back and six luxury suites as well. It's well situated. You've obviously got Soy 7 and 8, Soy 6 just down there. Lots of entertainment zones here as well. Uh, lots of places to eat, fast food, etc. So well situated, very, very modern and new looking hotel. You could be staying here in time for Christmas. Final hotel we're going to take you today is here. Uh, sort of the back of Second Road by the Hollywood and the Excite Discos over there. Soy 6, just a stone's throw away over there. This is the Leela Hotel. Good price for this one on Agoda, only 799 baht for an SHA Plus approved hotel. So a little bit cheaper. Don't really know much about it. Doesn't look very busy at the moment, but it will be taking your bookings. The name again is the Leela Hotel. And there are other hotels that we didn't go to. Couple for mention in Jom Tien. One of them is the Best Western in Jom Tien. Also the now Jom Tien Hotel. Both of those available for bookings and are SHA Plus approved. 
we've gone through uh, a lot of time contacting hotels on your behalf to try to give you a comprehensive guide to SHA Plus hotels because eventually all we want is for you to come over here and to come drinking in my bar. Really, as I said at the beginning of the video, it's not a clear situation. Hopefully on the channel, we'll be doing more videos about SHA Plus hotels and fingers crossed, we'll be able to actually go inside and definitely give you more information about airport transfers and transfers to lots of um, places that you can go to on the SHA Plus um, accreditation around Patio during your seven day stay. But I hope that's been helpful. By the way, we haven't uh, received any money from any of the hotels. We just want to try and make your uh, journey planning a little bit easier. Thanks uh, for watching. We'll have more information on this channel throughout this month. But for now, from me at the Leela Hotel, see you soon. Hey, the player in the game. Boy, to me, they're all the same. But I'm ready. No, never ready.